This week on the Clarion Rider Profile, Canadian wakeboarder Aaron Lapine. His career highlights include 5th at Wakestock in 2000, bronze medal at the Worlds in 99, silver medal at the Nationals in 99, and bronze medal at the Nationals in 98. My name is Aaron Lapine from Kelowna, British Columbia. I am 24 years old. Uh, I started wakeboarding on Okanagan Lake here. Uh, my dad bought a boat when we were younger to keep us out of trouble, give us something to do on the weekends. And we do everything from barefooting to kneeboarding. And then wakeboarding came out, and that was more of what I was into. I did a lot of skateboarding. And so I got and hopped on a wakeboard and just really took to it and, and just pretty much stuck with that since I hopped on it. We got into seriously wakeboarding probably about four years ago. Started, uh, went down to Florida. I uh, went to like, a mission, a Christian missionary school down there. Went to one of the uh, one of the wakeboard schools and met Charlie Patterson, and uh, he taught me some things, and just kind of got me really pumped on the sport. And ever since then, I've been heading down to Florida or basically chasing the sun around, trying to get uh, riding all year round. I think the biggest thing about wakeboarding that that uh, stoked me out was just the fact that you could go out there and just cruise if you wanted to, just do wake to wake stuff, but if you wanted to go and just get aggro, you could just crank it the wake and do whatever you want. It's a real, you know, it's more of a, an expression kind of thing. If you're just in a mellow, a mellow mood, you can go out and do wake jumps and, and whatnot, and if you just want to go kill it, you can do that too. I wouldn't say I take wakeboarding too seriously. I, it's, I, I, I think I took it seriously for a while. Uh, but this year it's just been a lot more fun, a lot more relaxed and, and, and trying to have a good time on the water and I think it's helped my riding. Uh, I'd have to say competitions to me are, uh, they're fun. Um, whenever I go, if I'm riding really good, just hanging out at home, I like to go to a competition and it kind of uh, helps to solidify if I actually am confident with the tricks that I know. It's a good way, it's almost like it weeds out what you have solved and what you don't. It's not always a, a perfect judge of that, but it, uh, it's a good little test and they're fun, I enjoy them. When I'm at home here, I run a wakeboard school, Team Lapine Wakeboarding. Uh, I run it out of the, the Grand here, Malibu Marine. And uh, it's been going pretty good this year. The weather's, weather's been a little iffy, but on the hot days, it keeps pretty busy. Uh, I get a lot of families from different resorts on the lake, so I'm just cruising, cruising around the lake, picking them up at different docks. It's a good way to uh, keep wakeboarding and be able to stay in the sport and make some money. Here on in with wakeboarding, I'd like to, uh, I'd like to continue teaching. Uh, I enjoy teaching and traveling. I like to travel as much as possible. As far as traveling, I've been able to go to Kuwait, which I went to last year, uh, and taught, taught wakeboarding out there. I spent uh, a couple months this winter in Australia. I've been to Florida a bunch. It's a good place to be. Lots of wakeboarding, lots of good riders. It really pushes your riding. And I'd say that if, if you're serious into wakeboarding, to get down there and, and just to hook up with the people and meet the people and, and, and ride as much as you can down there. If I had to thank anybody for, for getting me into wakeboarding, I have to say my folks, just for the fact that when I was younger, you know, buying a boat just kind of took off from there. And of course, my sponsors have helped me in, in the past, you know, three, four years, and that they played a big part. My brother as well, just kind of pushing each other and just going out there in the weekends and having a good time. We were your typical weekend wallies out in Okanagan Lake, you know, trying to hit it as hard as we could.